I guess. This is going to be a layers add a smile to a snowy owl video. Uh, on the right hand side here I have my layers panel open. If yours is not, you can go to Window and select Layers and it'll open on the right hand side there. I have two images open here. I have the snowy owl and I have a smile that I stole from the web. I'm going to select my snowy owl. <clears throat> I'm going to make this its own layer instead of a locked background layer like it is by double clicking on it and just saying OK. And that's layer zero. That's the snowy owl. If you want, you can change the name of it. Click inside here. And we'll say snowy owl. Now I'm going to duplicate that layer. Or actually I'm going to create a new layer by selecting down here. Um, create new layer. I'm going to go to the teeth. I'm going to select all. Edit copy. Come back over the owl, make sure my blank layer, layer 1, is selected. And I'm going to say edit paste. And that brings my teeth in. And it brings them in above my owl, which I don't want. So I'm going to take my owl layer, just grab it, and I drag it up over the teeth. Now the owl's on the top with the teeth down below. So on my owl, with that layer selected, I'm going to add a layer mask by hitting add layer mask. Once that's done, I'm going to make sure that my <clears throat> colors are set to black and white. I'm going to have black on top and I'm going to hit B for the brush tool, which I'm going to make a little bit bigger with the, my right bracket key. <clears throat> and my layer mask is selected here. I'm going to start painting on the owl and that's going to open it up through to the <laughs> the teeth below. Now, as you can see, it didn't get what I wanted. I just started to create where I want the teeth to be. So I painted through a little bit. And now I'm going to take the move tool. I'm going to right click on the owl and select layer one, which is the layer in the background. I'm going to take the transform in the corner here and I'm going to make it smaller. Kind of center it underneath the, the beak. I can see through the Feathers right here, some of the teeth there. And that looks pretty good. I'm going to come back over here and select the snowy owl. I'm sorry about that. I have to apply this first. Apply. Select the hand tool. <clears throat> come back over here and select the mask again. Hit B for the brush again. I'm going to make the brush smaller. And this is a relatively soft brush. I'm going to right click on the image with the brush up there and I'm going to, you're going to see the size is at 70 and the hardest is at 0 which means the outside edge of the brush is very soft when it paints on the image. Now I painted through right there which I don't want to do. I'm going to switch to white here by hitting the X key and now when I paint I'm going to be painting back onto the image. So I'm going to paint these lips out or the tops of them anyway. Bring the feathers back just by being careful going over. And do the same down here. That's not too terrible. Okay, so that's a pretty creepy looking smile. Actually, I'm going to exit back up here again. I'm going to bring some of this back in. Just by painting with black, I'm painting through the layer again, bringing a little bit of those lips back in. <clears throat> I'm going to make it quite a bit smaller and just do this corner over here as well. All right. That isn't too bad. Right there. All right. So. Now that I have that done, I'm going to flatten the layer by, you can either do it up here in the layers palette, say layer, flatten layer, flatten image, or you can come over here right to the layers palette and select this menu, fly out over here and say flatten image. 
Now, I'm going to make the smile a little more pronounced, a little creepier, by duplicating the layer again, which is Control J. I'm going to come up to Filter, select Liquify, use a brush a little bit smaller than this, and I'm just going to grab the corner of the mouth and bring it up. And again, the corner of the mouth and bring it up. The Liquify tool is can be pretty fun. And say OK. And now I can flatten my layer again. And there you have it. There's another creepy snowy owl smile. This one creepier than the last. And you can save that as a JPEG. Hope you liked it, guys.